there, I'm Tracy Rose and welcome to this video. In today's video, I'm going to share with you the one thing that is pretty much sabotaging all wannabe video marketers. And it's really upsetting because I see this happening all the time. I see so many amazing professionals who have I just think unlimited potential. I can see it in them and they can't see it in themselves. Now I get it. In the beginning with videos, I didn't really go hard with the, my videos. I didn't really put myself out there too much in the beginning because I was scared. I wanted everything to be perfect. So if you are a perfectionist, that is actually the one thing that is holding you back. Really, I think you're actually being a bit selfish. Now I don't mean to be mean, but think about it like this. If you have this knowledge or you have this, um, you know, that you're the type of person that can encourage people and help people in some sort of way, by not doing videos, you're holding that knowledge and that inspiration within you. You're not sharing it with the people that need it the most. So you're being selfish. People need you. They need your encouragement. They need your wisdom. They need your skills. They need you to teach them what you are good at. Now, even if you are new to your marketplace and you think, well, actually, I'm not that much of an expert. I don't have that much wisdom. I don't know what I'm really talking about. Um, you know, you can go and learn some stuff to teach people. I remember in the beginning, I didn't really know things. So I went on some webinars. I took notes. I read some books. I came up with some ideas and I just put together a few little couple of minute videos and shared it with people. Now, look, did I have a huge following from the beginning? No, it kind of took time, but over time, people have come to trust me in two different niches. By doing videos and getting myself out there in front of my target audience, you become like an authority in your marketplace. People look for you to teach them things. Videos don't have to be perfect. In fact, I still do videos from my iPhone in my car. You know those ones? I don't know if you've seen them, but I sometimes I do videos and I'm driving in my car and it's like the camera's sort of perched up somewhere, right? Do you want me to tell you how I do that? I get a really, really technologically advanced hairband <laughs> yes, something I put into my daughter's hair to make ponytails. I wrap the hairband around my phone and my rear vision mirror. And I drive. And I talk. <laughs> and a lot of the time, I don't edit those videos at all. So I know I've kind of chopped and changed and um, you know edited this little video a bit and it's got some music underneath. But that's because I have the time to do it today. If you are authentic about the message you want to share, people will feel it in their heart. Your energy will come through the video. If you really want to help people with something in their lives, that will shine through the video, no matter how imperfect it is. So I hope this video has helped you. I am actually going to put together a video mastermind group on Facebook. Um, I'm just putting that together. So if you're interested in that, there should be a link around this video. Click on it um, if you want to find out some more details about that. Otherwise, more tips and tricks about attracting leads, attracting customers with different strategies for your business, head over to my website, tracyrose.com. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. You know what? Cats are really